been a rough three days. Uh, I feel like I've been surveilled. I feel like I came upon something that uh, was new to me. Might be new to you as I explain it. It may be in the day or night. It may be visible or invisible. But in this case, it was visible. It kept following me around. The shape of this thing that followed me was similar to this. I'm not known to be necessarily paranoid, but it drove me to that belief that I just may be. And I was on the verge of some sort of discovery or psychological breakdown. Hey everyone, I woke up this morning and realized I had to make a difficult decision to let go of the person who was editing my videos and find a new editor. Even this new guy didn't seem to know what he was doing. Don't cut to this shot, you idiot! Red balloon floating. So I decided to take a walk around my neighborhood. <gasps> without any idea that I would eventually arrive upon some sort of symbol that would affect the next few days. And that's the basis of this video. I decided during the course of the day to indulge myself in my hobby of analyzing soil. The soil that is contaminated or possibly infiltrated by particles that fall from flying objects in the sky. Hey, this is what I'm talking about with this new editor. My hypothesis on this sort of investigation and analyzation came up to the fact that these were once small particles, but now suddenly they were large and 3D and visual and easy to be seen in the day or night. After I collected my samples and sent them to the lab, I decided to tend to the grounds of my estate. I did some raking. some clipping. And eventually I figured that still there was something watching me. I tell you, I ended up on an ocean liner and I was like, this is kind of nice, I could use a vacation. I'm always like running from one time zone to the other. And then I asked one of the passengers, I said, what ship is this anyways? And they said, it's the Titanic. And I'm like, ah, I'm getting out of here. Okay, 
got the symbols. After a while, I realized it was to the point where I had hallucinations and delusions and perhaps even nightmares about casting this thing to the wind, about throwing it out of my reality. It was driving me absolutely crazy. Once I realized everything was in the clear, I had to run to Target and get some kitty litter. However, every block I drove, every street light I went through, I still felt like there was something in my shadow following me. Ultimately, this experience was harrowing, but enlightening for me, and hopefully for you, it may have been mildly amusing. Amusing. We must realize that this is not just something that may happen to just me or one person, 
but it can happen to you at any given time. Benefit from a tight shot.